I know firsthand what this war with the Zen has cost us. How many more need to die before we realize that the time has come for us to put aside our pride and focus not on division, but unity? Does Zinyak have a strong personality? Absolutely. But then again, so did the previous president. And you know what? When I look at the two of them, I see more similarities than differences. Both have proven leadership experience. Both maintain their composure in high-pressure situations. Both have a love of Jane Austen. But most importantly, both of them will not stop until they get what they want. For this war to end, we need to stop rattling sabers and realize that victory doesn't come from annihilating an enemy, but by making an enemy your friend. All of us are heroes in our own stories. The time has come for us to grow up and have perspective. Earth will have its salvation, but it will come on the back of humility, not violence. Cute speech. Where's the part where you talk about selling out humanity? Humanity? Does that mean the nine of us? Earth is gone because you provoked a madman. I trusted you, Keith. And I trusted you. The country trusted you. And look where that led us. So what, you're putting your faith in Zinyak? Giving up your free will to be ruler of some bullshit daydream? You don't get it. Zinyak said he can restore Earth. All I have to do is kill you. He's lying to you. Maybe. But there's billions of lives at stake. If he's telling the truth, what's one life for the greater good? You sound just like Julius. He was right.
worry, everyone loses to me. Keith! Keith, stop! Damn it. Things. How do they even get the tank balls through the doors? They can bend the simulation to their whim. They. I'm venting, Matt! Let it go! President.
I know where they're keeping Kinsey. Keith. We had a deal, my friend. Now what am I supposed to do with a naughty little boy like you? Ah. Enjoy your requiem, Mr. David. <laughs> Hell am I? Matt, you there? Matt? Matt? Oh shit. Crazy mother! Hey! Stay away from me! Keith, you know better! I'm telling you, you dumb son of a bitch! I'm trying to save your life! You couldn't even save your own. Keith! Listen to me! I'm giving you a choice. Get away from me! Let him go! They have him bad. Hey, I'm Roddy. Roddy Piper. Hey, I'm the President of the United States. Sure. Why not? Well, Prez, we got visitors. Johnny? Keith sold out someone very important to me. Whatever trance he's in, I need him snapped out of it. He's going crazy. He thinks we're all out to kill him. Anything happens to Kinsey, and I will be. What is this place? A television broadcasting tower. What the hell's he gonna do with the broadcast tower? He's a crazy man with a microphone. What do you think he's gonna do? Ladies and gentlemen of America, the threat is right in front of us. An alien presence has taken over your friends and family. It's everyone you know, everyone you see. Nobody can- You got it all wrong, Keith. Zinyak's in your head. He's got you all confused. Keith, listen to me. The Zinyak guy is bad fucking news. You! I told you to get away! Get the fuck away from me! You're not gonna kill me, motherfuckers! Shit! Stop them! Is anyone counting these kills? <laughs> He's headed for the roof! The whole world will know the truth! The satellite's what's controlling Keith. You take care of it, I'll handle it. I'll take out the CIDs! The what? Never mind, I got this!
with the president! Kinsey's recording this. You did it! The shield's down! Satellite's down. Did it work? No, the brainwashing is too ingrained. I'll have to beat it out of them. If you want to know where your friend is, now's the time to ask. Where is Kenzie, Keith? Where did Sinyak put Kenzie? Tell me, Keith! Jeez. Jeez. She's in...
Keith, I think you got some unresolved issues. You don't know what happened, kid. Now come on, we've got to save Kinsey. I wish we could call Roddy for help. No one calls Roddy for help. He shows up where he's needed most. Let's go. I got from Keith was a code of You bad boss. Okay. Apparently he overheard Zinyak telling one of his subordinates a series of numbers somehow connected to Kinsey's location. Uh, I bet these digits line up with some proprietary coordination system used by the simulation, but I don't have access to that. We need someone who's able to plug directly into the simulation. Send the data to Sid. We'll take it from there. Data received. Hmm. Very interesting. It seems... Ah! Oh, shit! What's happening? I don't know. I... 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 Oh, here I go! Uh, Matt, I'm... following Sid. I'm going to hack the code to find out where Sid is going. Don't touch anything! Kenzie had a thing for bunnies? If I had to guess, it looks like this sigil is connected to some sort of secret room. A secret room? Clever girl. Time to see what's in it. Are you sure this is the right place? Absolutely. What the fuck is all this? A map of the simulation. Where are all the broken shillelaghs? If it would make the map more understandable to you, I could create a holocaust. God, no, we're good. So can you find Kinsey? In theory, yes. The time-consuming part will be identifying Kinsey's brainwaves in a sea of other data. Find whatever looks the most abnormal. It's probably her. Insulting, yet accurate. Good luck. Oh, man, 
And this place, me. Kenzie, great, come on, let's get out of here. If you want to speak with my husband, he'll be home this afternoon. Kenzie? Say, I'm afraid I don't have much of a green thumb. Oh, can you help me get this bulb to sit right? No, Kenzie, I can't. What? What are you doing? Hurry! I'm being held captive by- Kenzie? What just happened to Kenzie? Ooh, that must have been a decoy. That's smart. See if there are any more around. Matt, I found another Kenzie. I... Wait! Ah, oh, sh! What's going on? The cops have Kenzie. This is the real you. Golly! That bump sure was a doozy, wasn't it? Get to City Hall. Hurry! Okay. Do you remember Cyrus Temple? Oh, the thug who launched a nuclear missile to take out America because he's a big baby that hates losing? Yeah, name rings a bell. He's in charge here. Are you serious? Should he be dead? Not in Kinsey's mind, no. Why is he so much younger and not in uniform? Cyrus is Kinsey. Matt, give me a gun. I can't! God it, Matt, give me something! He has speaker boxes all over town. If you really want to shut him up, you'll have to take them all out. I will continue this town's tradition of quiet, peaceful reflection and strict obedience. I will enforce Whoa, the what just happened? our society, the well-oiled machine it needs to be in order for us to all prosper. Our world is too precious for us to confuse the natural order. What are you doing, honey? Men are labor and shows in our firm jawlines, our strong backs, and our healthy sense of competition. We must Matt, man, come on. You gotta give me some kind of weapon. I'm telling you, this simulation is locked. Oh, oh, wait a minute. Excited, Matt. This can't be good. I've left you something in a weapons crate. It falls on them to raise children who are obedient, respect their elders, and are accepted of their future roles in the world. Children are to be seen but never... Um, a music gun? Seriously, Matt? I told you, no weapons allowed. But the power of music can overcome all obstacles. Fuck it, I'm in. Music gun it is. of happiness, we must remember those people are a front of the firmament of what makes us a perfect union. Shut your filthy mouth, Cyrus. We find this especially in the media put out by big business. All the there are two more. Propaganda. 
panda truck, huh? Come at me! Enough of this bullshit. One more to go. Oh, yes, I can. President. Stop me, huh? Oh, I don't think so. Cyrus, time for the second part of this plan. Which is... Trust me, you'll like it. The Sam Hill? Hey, I thought this was a party! Let's dance! Since now, you hoodlum. You wanna dance? Dance with me. Hey, I've got a new track for you to try. A new track? I'm uploading it now. Give it a shot. Oh, check you out, DJ Miller. <laughs> Better you than me.
Kenzie, let's get the fuck out of here. Hey, you swore! Kenzie, you're okay. You don't tell anyone what you saw. Do you understand me? Kenzie, it really wasn't all that... I said anyone. Hey, you got it. Just saying it was a cute poodle skirt. <laughs> it's like I'm inside a video game. Wink. <laughs> <laughs>